Hey, what's up, Tannen? How do you do? How do I do? I do good. How long have you been here? And if you don't mind me asking, what's your story? <laughs> oh, sure, why not? My name is Tannen. I've been here for about two weeks now. I started out as street trash, pickpocketing businessmen in Freeside. Abraham found me on the street when I was 16. I was eating a dead rat. Nice. He took pity on me and paid me to get information about his contracts. Well, one day I was eavesdropping a little too closely on a group of syndicate businessmen. They discovered me and made me their slave. I've been making weapons and ammo for them in this here prison for a while now. Usually the syndicate kills people who know too much. Um, where's the syndicate base of operations? Right. They're located in Freeside, near Cerulean Robotics. They're probably expecting you. Why does everyone like Cerulean Robotics? Are you alright? I'm doing fine, thanks. Nice. Well, you're free to go. Oh, I know. The thing is, I'm kind of used to this place. I got water, food, and a roof over my head. I'll manage here. I mean... I murdered everyone, so you're probably not going to get food and water. See you around. Like, they're all dead, Tannen. Alright, well, we're leaving. Good luck not dying. Hey, look, the little farmer, he fell. Last words of a dead man. Oh, boy. I tripped getting off the toilet. I'm Doc Mitchell. Whoops. There we go. Day 24, the men are treating me like shit. They beat me daily, mocking my dead family. I tried to expose them. They wouldn't even give me the easiness of an ex execution. I'm stuck here for trying to end corruption in the NCR, and some third party, party organization has this hell for me to live in. Day 89. They let me work with Tan today. We made 22 bullets and about five silencers that they're probably going to use to kill innocent people and politicians. Tannen is a fine young gentleman with a life to live. He's too young to be in this goddamn place. Warden was breathing on my neck. We didn't talk about anything important, just small talk. Day 101. Wonder how long it'll be before they notice. Found a knife hidden in the mattress. When it comes to suicide in prison, you can't complain much about your options. I'm gonna join my family soon. The men are drinking in the back. They're having a laugh about the death of some Zimmer character. How he was a teacher's pet. They probably won't notice my squealing as I try to cut myself without making a noise. Wonder if stabbing myself in the neck will be quicker. Maybe I should do the veins. I'll flip a bottle cap. Oh, that's sad. You did it. You did it. I'm sorry. Heads. I don't know what you did. Did you cut your balls? No, you definitely cut that neck. I'm sorry about that. You know what? You can come back as a zombie. I won't blow your head off. Ooh, projection. Oh, Syndicate HQ keycard. Awesome. Good thing I found that. That would have been bad. Yeah, there was a key card back there. You missed. We've got it all at the Silver Rush. What, you're not gonna say anything? You don't recognize us? You all suck on these two nuts? No, we don't. Come on. Oh boy. Jesus Christ, just come on. What else you want? We we got a good time. We got music. We got every piece of music. We got a whole. We download all the music off of Kaza. Look, we're Jawas. Just do you want to be a Jawa? I don't know if we have enough. Am do we have another Jawa thing? We do. Here you go, wait. Here you go. You be a Jawa. We're gonna have to shrink you. Dummy. There you go. Now you're a Jawa. We gotta shrink you down now. I think it's eight. Yeah, there we go. Come on, let's go. Come on, Daily Atomic Ring, and we'll shrink you down and become a little baby Jawa. You know, that's a good time. Become a Jawa. Boutini. Alright, people. You ready to kick some ass? Let's roll! Three, two, one. Breach. You got a death wish, friend. And I'm here to grant it. Okay. Oh, God. They got a lot of people. Get behind cover. We're Jawas. Move up, move up, move up, people. We got a slippery snake over there. 
Hey, this guy's still sitting there. Come on, now, I'm gonna bring the rest of your birthday. Hey, watch out! Had enough? Hey, Michael Phelps is here. Don't shoot Michael Phelps. He's a national treasure, damn it. Don't you run away from me, bitch. Over here. Oh, Slow shit. Me, Tom Gray. We got Sparts, sparts, sparts. Come on. Damn it, Michael Phelps. Damn it, Phelps. Why'd you gotta do it? Come on, Mike. What are you doing? Come on, you could have lived. Looks like the price is right. Oh, wait. Looks like the price is wrong. Phelps Journal. Damn, I love this syndicate shit. All I do is swim and practice my knife throwing skills at any squatter who comes by. Also impress the sweet, sweaty businessmen who come in here. Apparently I'm making the syndicate look normal and giving them some credibility. The water moderates the, moderates the temperature too, so that's nice. And I'm going in the Olympics. Hey, we killed Michael. F oh, God. Not like this. No. Not like this. Superman, no here. I'm too far deep. I took this job to pay the bills, feed my babies. I was told all I had to do was accounting. It helped launder some money, too. I had gun training, but I didn't think I'd ever need it. I can hear the shots. Price isn't going to stop the courier. He's arrogant. This message isn't going to reach anyone. The courier's probably going to step on it with a stain of blood. I'm going to die. I'm going to die on my own terms. I don't want to get blown apart by C4 and lay twitching for a few minutes. I want to get headbutted. I don't want a crazed murder to be the last thing I see. 22 isn't a noble death, but at least it isn't a painful one. Oh, look at you, little dead thug. Look, if you would have just talked to me, maybe I would have, you know... Oh Hold it right there, courier. It is I, the guy. <laughs> you may have handled price, but I am your match. Time to die. I've only got one eye. My favorite food is eating french fries. Holy shit. No vacancy in this hotel. Huh. Take out these old men in front of me first. This lady's having a baby. We got him, we got him, we got him. Everyone take out. Take out the stragglers. Where'd the guy go? There he is. Take him. Oh, God. He's a big old man. Shit. Yeah, that's right. You run, little bitches. We're cool. Uh. Knife. You are a big man. You you're like Michael Jordan. I don't know how big Michael Jordan is, but you know what I mean? I tell me got slinkies. I can move uh. on their own. Tom you don't. Wrangler. You don't. I've been there. You're a liar. Stop. This is why we don't take you anywhere. This is why we only pick you up if you're on the way. Fate and choices. Spartacus. <gasps> I'm Spartacus. No, I'm Spartacus. No, I'm Jawa King. When the Legion pursued escaped slaves from Flagstaff, Arizona, Spartacus and his remaining men supposedly stayed behind to buy time for the women and children. That's the official story. But the NCR is full of liars and propaganda. Spartacus actually abandoned his men, fear getting the best of him. He was ashamed of showing his face at FOB Omega and sought sanctuary in our organization instead. He showed humility at first. He believed we could set him up for life and give him a new identity. He wanted to forget his slave life and the horrors of the rebel atrocities against child soldiers. He had PTSD, among other things, however. It was only a matter of time before he went on a power trip or a killing spree that he would have expected us to clean up after. You and I both know that. You see, the Syndicate does what is necessary. It's not just some evil co corruption corrupting organization. Organized crime is a necessity. It can be controlled, moderated, regulated. The NCR is so focused on expansion and war that it does not recognize its internal problems. We bring attention to those things. You're a wild card courier. You ruin everything. And soon you're gonna wish you walked away as soon as Sellers gave you that letter for Bradley. Oops. Not a fire can I help it. Pop pop, I'm a Jawa. Pop pop, I'm a Jawa. Gonna make you scream in the shower. Cool looks at you in fear and cocks her shotgun. Cock your guns and close your lips. Cause I'm breaking these off, including your hips. I'm a Jawa. Oh, look at you, angry Maxwell. Furiosa, you look at you. You're from that movie. 
beautiful job in that movie, by the way. Was, if everyone hasn't seen the new Mad Max, go see it. I think it's out on blue DVD. I like that. That was a nice little touch. Oh boy. We got gushers in a ball pit. <laughs> <laughs> Poor a Morton oh, Joe. Boy. We yeah. got gushers in a ball pit. No, you Janet, don't. The atomic Wrangler. You want me to take a picture, Janet? It'll last longer. Merc. So, uh. You know what? I keep saying, like, I wouldn't kill you if you don't do anything. What do you need? So, you know what? I'm gonna let you live. You get to live. See? All you got, the courier, the courier can forgive. He can be peaceful. Well, well, well. You've made it to the end. I always thought I'd bring the fight to you, but it seems I was wrong. Your perseverance is admirable. Are you part of the Men in Black? Examine your surroundings. I've got snipers, robots, and a behemoth. You've really fucked yourself this time, courier. Zimmer gave you a fair chance, but I don't have any duel of katanas in mind. In fact, I trashed them. Those teachings are no longer relevant. Actually, I got my kick my- I got my- I don't plan on letting you win, I but I do know that we can have a conversation before my men and I cut you down to blood red mist and bone powder. Ooh, I like that. Perhaps we can clear up any misunderstandings. I'm sure you have some questions and last words. So what's your story? Your voice giving me a migraine. Can we get the show on the road? Can I get off that list? I mean, I'm gonna die anyway, right? What do you have to say about Marco? Duck behind the sandbags. Draw your weapon. What does K stand for? My name is Kang. Ned Kang. Not very intimidating, is it? To reduce it to one letter provides a shroud of mystery. I'm gonna call you Kangaroo. Is that okay? You're probably wondering why speaking it is an offense punishable by death. Even Zimmer did not have my permission. It's because he called you Kangaroo? To control the way people talk gives authority. Respect. A mentor must have respect to teach his pupil, and a leader must have respect to lead. Kang, 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 Ned, 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 Kang, Ned, Kang, Ned, Kang, Kang, Ned, Kang, Did I mention Ned? Die, you bitches! Your voice gave me my... Can I... Oh, oh, God. What do you have to say about Marco? Marco's gotta be dead. I'm assuming that the 80s killed him, or you did. Either way, he's out of the picture. I mean, there's a lot of coke in the 80s. The outfit used to think he was a threat, but the difference between him and you is that he minds his own business. Or he did, anyway. Before the Duck Wars. How close were you with Zimmer? Like I said in my letter, he was like a son to me. Full of potential. Skilled with a katana. A weapon I have distanced myself from. Jesus, Zimmerman killed me. Um, who the fuck is Zimmer? Tell me about the Syndicate. You waltz into my headquarters, kill half <laughs> my hitmen, all of my hired mercs, and want an oral history? Yes. Is this an attempt at humor? Yeah. The Syndicate is bigger than you. It's got a bigger kill count to its name. Soon, it will influence the Mojave more than you ever will. And if you're thinking of joining, the only thing you'll be joining is hell. Uh, um... I wish to resolve this peacefully. I request that you leave the Mojave, and I'm sorry about Zimmer. Have some honor. Find me one-on-one. -on -one. Coward. Who the fuck is Zimmer? Just another body to add to your kill count, huh? Are you trying to insult me? Have you really forgotten? No, I didn't forget. I'm joking with you. Zimmer was my apprentice. I taught him the ways of the katana, yet he somehow lost to you in the basement of a meat market. You killed him. Hum. Hum, hum, hum. Did I mention Ned? Amusing. Eh, not so much. Uh oh. Well. One on one! I won't make the same mistake Zimmer made. That's a no. Okay, you're right. That's you you're smart. You're a smart little baby. Leave. Very funny. You're not leaving this base alive. Okay, alright. I'm gonna I'm not gonna say anything. Did you give the silent treatment to Zimmer, too? Go ahead. You're only stalling the inevitable. I can be patient for revenge. And I can be patient for patience. All right, uh, remain silent once more. He stares intently. He stares intently. He stares intently. Ah, uh, do I need Wild Wasteland? 
There was a wild wasteland I missed. Actually, I missed a bajillion wild wastelands. Couldn't have it on. All right, let's do it. Fuck. Feel free to take cover, any of my companions. Oh my god, they're coming through the sides. I'm running, I'm going on the side, I'm going on the side. Oh god. This guy from Men in Black. Shoot his legs. He's gonna be running like an old grandpa poop his pants. Oh god. Crap, crap, no wait. I think we got him. I think we might have. Yep, totally. Definitely. Yep, we got him. <laughs> Ooh, Kevlar. Fusion syndicate suit. Oh, nice. Now you're naked. Damn, we killed everyone. Well, except for that guy over there. Ah, forget this. That's the behemoth over there. Oh, the behemoth is fighting the, uh... Huh. Oh, jeez. What? <laughs> did they... Did they not fight me? I guess they had to have... There you go, you're fine. All right, we're gonna leave. No need to fight us. Oh, uh, actually, let's let's try this. Hey, buddy, sorry I shot your friend. Here you go. We cool now? See, I give and I taketh away. Yeah, you cool now. All right. Mission accomplished. Hey, it's Buzz Aldrin. And a Morton Joe. Things are looking up for us. Things are looking up for the Jawas. Things are looking up for everyone. Things are looking up for us. Things are looking up for us. Wow, I can't spell. Resurrector? What are you talking about? Hello. Hey, see? What do you need? You can pay for your babies now. Ba Things are looking up for us. Things are looking up for us. Things are looking up for us. Things are looking up, yeah, yeah, girl. Things are looking up for us. Things are looking up for us. She's like, did I just come back to life and and then was I given 9,000 caps? Because, yes, you were. Things are looking up for you. Things are looking up for the Chabaku. Things are looking up for you. Oh, yeah. All right, Abraham. Don't you sit down. What can I do for you? Stop eating them donuts. Uh, I destroyed the Mojave branch of the Syndicate. Hot damn. Really? I didn't think you'd survive. Thanks. Well, I'm all out of work for you. Take this money and have a great day. Thank you. One more thing. You might be wondering what this means for the Mojave. It means there'll be less corruption in the NCR, which sounds good to me. Ooh, we leveled up. Ghoul bounties too. What can I do for it? Oh, awesome. We leveled up. We leveled up. Actually, it doesn't matter, but I'm doing sneak. We leveled up. Uh, we leveled up. Yeah, doesn't matter, but I'm doing sneak. Anyhow. Mm. All right, everybody. Looks like that is, is the end of Ghoul bounties too. Hope you all enjoyed this. This is a fantastic sequel. Ghoul Bounties 1. I had a blast playing this. Thanks for watching, everyone. Hope you enjoyed. And, uh, yeah. 
awesome stuff. Fantastic. I, I, I had a blast with this. So, thanks for watching. Hope you enjoyed. I know I did. And I shall see you in the Jawa future. Oh, hey, Look at that little somersault. Boom. Oh, yeah. What's up? Welcome to the future. Oh, hey.